Hi, I'm Sean Gann, and this is Minute Math. And today, we're going to learn about adding and subtracting polynomials. And we're going to simplify each expression. So, if I was given this polynomial, 3x to the 4th minus 3x minus, parentheses again, 3x minus 3x to the 4th. Okay, this one's tricky. There's a lot of 3s, a lot of x's, and a lot of minus signs. We gotta keep them in line, okay? I'm gonna convert everything to adding a negative because I like that. I find it easier. So I have 3x to the fourth, let's take our time here, instead of subtraction, plus a negative. Now, I didn't, um, I couldn't simplify anything in the parentheses here, so I have no problem eliminating that. Now, I can't eliminate this right away, but if I distribute the negative across, I can't. So uh, distribute that minus, or right, subtraction there, subtracting the 3x, the same thing as adding a negative 3x. Distribute that to the th uh, 3x and distribute it again over here to the subtracting a negative uh, subtracting a negative 3x to the fourth right double negative so we have plus a positive 3x to the fourth here okay so now I'm going to rearrange putting my like terms together and my highest degree first so 3x to the fourth right here highest degree is the fourth power this one here is plus a 3x to the fourth highest degree right now I have just the x's left we have plus a negative 3x and plus a negative 3x, okay? So, combine our like terms now. 3x to the fourth plus a 3x to the fourth is a 6x to the fourth. And then a negative 3x plus a negative 3x is a negative 6x, so we can just put subtraction instead of plusing a negative, or adding, plusing a negative, <laughs> adding a negative, uh, minus 6x right there, and there we have it, okay? We have 6x to the fourth minus 6x. So let's recap. We're given 3x to the 4th minus 3x parentheses minus parentheses 3x minus 3x to the 4th parentheses. I like to make everything adding a negative, so I make that uh, adding a negative 3x right here. And distribute the minus sign here, it gives me adding a negative uh, adding a negative 3x and then adding a positive, double negative, make sure we distribute, positive 3x to the 4th. Now I rearrange using the commutative property with my like terms first and highest degree first. Let's double check, we double check to make sure everything you know, was transferred down. 3x to the 4th right there. Then this 3x to the 4th right there, negative 3x, negative 3x. Fantastic. Now I combine my like terms. 3x to the 4th plus 3x to the 4th is 6x to the 4th. And then negative 3x plus a negative 3x is a plus a negative 6x, which we just wrote as minus 6x. Okay, for my final answer, it's not really neat to have it as a plus a negative. So we have our final answer here, which is 6x to the 4th minus 6x.